Don't. The, uh, come on. He said don't, and it puckered right back up into my anus. What's up, you guys? This is Tyler or Explosify here, and I'm here with my friends. We got Kyle on my right and Captain. Colin, Captain, on my left here. We're playing Are You Smarter Than a Fifth Grader? They're going to go head to head here and <laughs> see who is actually smarter than a fifth grader. I took some questions uh, from online, and uh, I'm kind of nervous. I feel like they're going to get this pretty quickly. So, <laughs> you want to show the class what you Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I was gonna get something going like this. You're calling. I, gotta, I was going for a dinosaur hold on, with hold a penis. On. <laughs> let's, let's see that. I might have to blur that part. <laughs> so this is the first question, so it is a first grade question. Poor shit. What if I can't answer it? The first Thanksgiving was celebrated by Native Americans and what other group of people? Alaskan people, pilgrims, Asian people, or Cherokee people. Okay, what happens if you can't spell it? <laughs> I, I, I don't know. You're, terrible at spelling. You won't get reduced points, so. We're gonna start out with Kyle here. I said pilgrims. He's got pilgrims. Because I'm not fucking stupid. What do you have over here? Pilgrams. Okay. Pilgrams. Because we sell grams at a time. Yes, you guys are both did correct. Correctly? Did I spell it correctly though? That yes. is correct. Yeah, you did. The second first grade question. From which country did Mexico gain its independence in the 19th century? France, United States of America, Morocco, or Spain? Definitely sounds like a Spain question. Say, the, say, say it again. No, the, just the, Really? No, sorry, just the answers. I, answers. Just the answers. Yeah. You don't want the whole thing. You don't need the answers to know. Are you sure about that? The answers are France... United States of America, Morocco, or Spain? What do you think? You don't gotta say the answer, but what do you think? Lightweight, baby! <laughs> You're good? Spain. Spain? Yeah. Why do you think it's Spain? Spanish. That's it? Oh yeah. my god. What France? do you think it is? Was it France? United States, you fucking dog! Where is Mexico on the map? But guess what? You're right. Was it France? It's Spain. Let's go, baby! I didn't quit! <laughs> yes! He got it right. I knew it was either fucking... Why are the Spaniards over Spain here? French. I knew they, it was either Spain dude, or French. Dude, did you... Have you ever looked up how much land Spain owned before we took Spain over the U.S.? Spain Spain's French. a bitch! <laughs> Spain and France owned so much shit. Dude, That's they owned... Had... They owned, like, all of Mexico. They owned like half the U.S. I'm drink my sorrows away. Fuck these second graders. <laughs> All right, give me your pen here. Second grade question: What city in the world was the first to be attacked with an atomic bomb? Nagasaki, Tokyo, Hiroshima, or Tog Lang? Oh fuck! <laughs> <laughs> it's one of the two. <laughs> Feeling confident about this one? I think so. Yeah. You think so? You felt confident about the last one too. Yeah, no, I got it. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Hiroshima. Ah! Why do you think it's Hiroshima? Hiroshima and Nagasaki. I thought it was. Uh, first one was Hiroshima, then they dropped shit over Nagasaki, and then Nagasaki got it. And they ate ass. Okay. What do you think? Yeah, they a. Well, huh? Which one, which one was A? A is Nagasaki. That one. You couldn't spell it? No. The correct answer was actually Hiroshima. <laughs> We're, we're going to the sec second, second grade question here. What are the first 10 amendments to the Constitution called? Laws, penal codes, bill of rights, or legislations? I was writing it before you even fucking said it, dude. <laughs> Sorry, can I have the answer repeated again? Yeah. 
Laws, penal codes, bill of rights, or legislations? Okay, I want to know. <laughs> Do you actually know this, or did you just... <laughs> did I just... What, what did I cheat off of my fucking iPhone? No, you heard how, how many letters I was fucking writing. <laughs> <laughs> Say the answers real quick. <laughs> They're all pretty fucking lengthy, buddy. There's You'll run one, out. There's only one that's correct, and it's three letters. <laughs> Laws? Three words, sorry. I was gonna say, if you wrote laws, buddy, we're gonna have to have to yeah. sit down. All right. <laughs> what? You, what? Actually, what do you have? Bill of Rights. Bill of Rights. Shit, he's right. Bill. <laughs> Bill O Rights. <laughs> <laughs> we're moving on to the third grade question. So the third round here. All right. This gonna get tough. The first third grade question. The first fireworks were invented in the seventh century in what country? Russia. United States of America, Germany, or China. <laughs> Goddamn, Kyle. Feeling confident now? I knew it. <laughs> oh, you knew it? All right, Colin. I've seen a lot of <laughs> You can't say it, dog. It's China. <laughs> it is China, yeah. Okay. <laughs> the second third grade question. This is where, in my opinion, I think it's a little hard. Okay. But uh, Julius Caesar was the emperor of what empire? The Greek Empire, the Empire of France, the Roman Empire, or the Spanish Empire? They're both writing very, uh, drawing very hard. Yeah. Me? Go. I'll go. Okay. Hey, dog, it's the Roman Empire. Okay. Okay. Greek. <sighs> Julius Caesar, Roman. Greek. You're Greek. What's the answer? <laughs> it is Roman. Let's go! So Colin takes the lead. What am I thinking of? Uh, a you're lot probably thinking of, of that, a lot of different guys. Yeah, <laughs> like Con lost. Constantinople or. No. Ulysses. Going into the fourth round, into the fourth grade questions here. All right, what? Right. <laughs> are they all? Are they all? Fucking multiple choice. Yes. I want to try one without getting any answers and just see what we come up with. Okay. Oh, really? Just do that. Yeah. You, want, you want to do this one? Yeah. What ancient civilization built the Machu Picchu complex in Peru? <laughs> well, hang on. No, hang on. Wait, Machu Picchu complex? So it's a building? Yes. It's okay, a, it's a town. Yes. It's Repeat the question. What Shouldn't ancient support? civilization built Machu Picchu the, or sorry, the Machu Picchu complex in Peru. I think I know it. People usually just say Machu Picchu. I think I know it. I've heard that a long time ago, but I don't think I've learned about it. Oh, you gotta look into it, dude. It's beautiful there. Is it? Yeah, I wanna go visit. Real. You're pretty confident, huh? I, yeah, that's gotten me so far. <laughs> <laughs> you are down one point, so. <laughs> you you kind of need this. He's writing quite he's a bit. He's <laughs> All right, I called your bluff, go ahead. I said the Incas. Incan Empire. I don't even know what an Inca is. Uh, <laughs> Bigfoot and his adopted sister. <laughs> <laughs> Surprisingly, Kyle got it right. It is the Incas. Thank you. Yes. <laughs> On to the second question of the fourth round here. Oh, really? Oh, man, you guys are going to want answers on this one. Who wrote the national anthem of the United States of America? Yeah, let's hear the answers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's hear the answers. Oh, bullshit, you know. <laughs> You know what's sad? The first name that came to mind was Thomas Edison, yet he had nothing to do with it. <laughs> Alright. Andrew Jackson, Benjamin Franklin, Francis Scott Key, or a soldier while fighting the British? Well, there's no tits in there. <laughs> uh, wait, wait, wait. What, what's the answers? The last one? A soldier while fighting the British was the last one. You guys are tied right now, by the way. Oh. I think I got it. I think I got it. All right, Kyle, go ahead. Francis. A soldier. I'm disappointed in you. Kyle got it right. All right, okay. going into the fifth and final round. Let's see, okay, we'll, we'll, we'll hear the question, then we'll decide if we want. Yes, okay. okay. But we both got to agree on it. Okay, okay. yeah. Okay. 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 What was the name of the last queen of France? Uh, I, I'm, I'd be down to here. Uh, 
Go ahead. Queen Marie Antoinette, Queen Mer- Mary Elizabeth I, Queen Victoria, or Queen Cassidy? Cassa who? <laughs> Can I hear A and B again? A and B. I know the first one's the Antoinette, bitch. I'll just read all four. Queen Marie Antoinette, Queen Mary Elizabeth I, Queen Victoria, or Queen Cassidy? Or Cassidy-A. I'm just gonna write a letter. <laughs> He's, okay. Yeah, you don't have to spell it out. I mean, Colin, I saw a party here. <laughs> what, okay. Well, I called your bluff. B. <laughs> the third bitch. <laughs> uh, neither of you got that right. No. This game's fucking right. So neither of you. Was it the day, bitch? Okay. It was Antoinette. Shit! I thought about that. I thought it was time. too obvious. All right. The French and Indian War, which began in 1754, became the North American theater of what worldwide war that lasted from 1756 to 1763? Fifth grade? No. There's no way. I feel like this is advanced yeah. U.S. Go, history go again? shit and shit. Okay. The French and Indian War, okay. which began in 1754, uh-huh. became the North American theater of what worldwide war that lasted from 1756 uh-huh. To 1763. <laughs> you want to hear the answers or no? Yeah, set out the answers. The answers? All right. The answers. The war to bring peace. The war to end all wars. No. The dark times. Or the seven years war. <laughs> Are you looking at me? <laughs> Yeah, he is. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> huh? <laughs> I said the Seven Years' War. What do you say? Dark times. Hey, there were some dark times, man. The sun goes down. <laughs> They're scared. He lost. He won. I know. You got it right. Well, that puts me up two and or three at this point. Yeah. So, so Kyle's officially smarter than the fifth grader and you, Colin. Thank God. That's just the drugs.